been a second since I did one of these. Hello. Hello. How's the crafty vlog sound? I'm Carolyn, the designer and chief nerd behind Cooley Craft, and the last time you checked in was a bazillion years ago. So let's get to it. What is happening lately? Um, I have a few projects that I want to share, chat about, and then also talk a little bit about sort of a bet that I'm having with myself. Get to that in a moment. So the title of this episode, if we're going to title it, is going to be a net, a bet, and a finished set. Hey! So since the last check-in, we have had a whole nother batch of kittens, which video magic. They're so cute. They were just born two days ago. We also have rebuilt a chicken coop that is over there that you can't see for the naughty chickens who keep escaping our other coop. We're in the middle of a huge drought here in the Midwest, so our garden is garbage. We also purchased a calf, video magic. His name is Dom. He is very cute. Um, he is named after a pasta sauce, which is funny. Um, but he is just under two months old. Um, he was born early May, and it is now late June. So yes, almost a month and a half. Yes, almost a month and a half. And we, he's super fun because we bottle feed him twice a day, which is very cute, but he's getting sassy. And after I finish recording this, I'm going over there just off camera to help finish building a, a fence, which is a lot more difficult when the ground is so dry. That's the, that's the farm updates. We're consolidating. We're doing a, a not a farm and coolie craft update. So the net part is someone has a room that's far too small and that room needs storage for stuffed animals. So the very observant among you may notice that this is the same fingering weight green wool that I crocheted my ball gown out of. Magic. This is the rhythm of the Remember that? Yes, it still needs a lining, so that'll be fun. Um, but this net is going to be finished hopefully this week and go up in a certain child's room. The bet part of the video that I was mentioning earlier is I am stash busting through the end of the year. So I want to reduce my stash either by using up or donating 2,000 grams because I cannot be bothered to calculate yardage and do all that math. 2,000 grams reduction in stash. I gave myself the exemption that my fiber subscription to Mother of Pearls bi-monthly fiber mystery package, that doesn't count for stash. My side quest goals are to have all my fiber stash spun up by the end of the year, everything on hand. Um, and there was another one. Why can't I remember it? I have no idea. There was another side quest, but that's a great segue. Since I'm so forgetful, I want to have other people as accountability partners. So I have started in my Discord server a fun little crew called Last Half Stash Bash. We're all about the we're all about the funny naming conventions right now. Uh, I'll drop the Discord link down in the chat in the description of the video. So do hop over, join. We're getting weird with what we're planning on our, our projects to finish up through the end of the year to meet our self-imposed goals. And then my finished set. I didn't bring out here with me, but video magic. I completed the gooseberry socks test knitting that I wanted to do. I have a couple of people that I'm also going to send the finished written pattern to to test 
but it's good to go. It's pretty much ready to be released out in the world. And I'm really excited about that. And then I used the motif on a hat band as well, which is here. It is a bazillion degrees out, so it's stupid to make a hat maybe, but I did it. Um, I think it looks cute. I was very frustrated with it while I was making it, just because the socks had such good definition in the motif because of the gauge I was knitting them at, and I felt like the hat lost some of that good graphic pop of the gooseberries. But I think it turned out really nice, so I'm very happy with it now. We're getting the very Wes Anderson smoky sunset uh, lighting, and I have to go build a fence, so I will be back next week with another update on the projects. There's a couple of things on the hook and needles that I didn't share today. Um, if you want sneak peeks of those, the Discord or Instagram are the place to be rude. Um, flies everywhere. Welcome to farm life. But yeah, until next time, stay crafty.